So it's been like a month since I've uploaded a video, but that's because I went on a trip of a lifetime recently. Uh, my friends invited me two days before they left to come along on their vacation with them. So I said, yes, of course. And we went to Haida Gwaii. That was a new experience for me, traveling the ferry for six hours and then hiking in rainforests and being on the ocean. It was really a special trip. So if you're interested to see what I did, I have another YouTube channel that I will provide the link in the description and you can see what I did. But I'm glad to be back painting now. So I acquired this uh, solid oak bedroom set recently and I want to do it in Annie Sloan's Svenska Blue. It's a fairly new color for her and I've never used it before. So I'm quite anxious to see what it will look like on this bedroom set. I think it will go perfectly in my bedroom. So I really appreciate you watching. If you want to see more videos, please subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Jesus dying and tears from heaven's eyes are the anguished drops of a father crying. Oh. This must be. Cross of love for God to peruse his only son. Jesus what a sacrifice to reach us. It had to be a cross. This must be a cross of love for God to bruise his only son. Jesus, what a sacrifice to reach us. It had to be a cross of love. must be a cross of love for God to bruise his, his only son. Jesus what a sacrifice to reach us. It had to be Jesus, what a sacrifice to reach us. It had to be a cross of love. to be a cross, cross of love, cross of
If you know me, you know I like to do the interior of cabinets in a different color. So this one is Florence, Annie Sloan's Florence. I had a bit of paint left over, so that's always handy. Then after two coats of paint and sanding all the pieces, I use Annie Sloan's clear wax to seal it all. I like to do it all in one um, section at a time and then buff it with a rag. I know some people like to do small sections and buff it, but I find it's just as well to do one large surface at a time. If you know Annie Sloan's colors at all, this Svenska blue is very similar to her duck egg blue. I'm not sure why she chose this color palette to do a new color with. You could probably add some white to her duck egg blue. I sure wish she would come out with a navy. Anyway, it looks really good in my chocolate bedroom and I'm very pleased with what I did.